Good YouTube. It's your boy, Curtis, aka Flex, coming to you with another episode of Dre 2, my first powerlifting meet. This one having to do with the bench press. Take a look at the video and I'll get back to you when it's done. Hey guys, let me start by saying that this morning was a real difficult morning. Not really just physically, but uh, mentally. And on the other side, the gym was uh, so full this morning. So uh, as you guys know, normally I would do my bench press. I would show, uh, you know, me doing the stretches and starting off with, uh, you know, the 135, which you see there. But uh, again, it was so busy that I just went straight to doing the 135. But I, I skipped, I didn't record the uh, stretches. Went to 135 and then I just started off doing my uh, 70%, uh, as I was telling you guys before, because I'm on the uh, the three of the 531 program for this week, week five. And uh, instead of doing three reps, what I'm supposed to do, I end up doing uh, five reps because I'm trying to push push the envelope a little bit until I start hitting some weight where I actually should follow the the five, the three, and the one. So uh, instead of doing the, the three reps, I did five reps at 70%. Then I did uh, five reps at uh, 205, which is 80%. And then I did uh, uh, five reps at 90%. After that, I felt a little sluggish, but I still continue on and went to uh, doing uh, incline dumbbell presses using uh, 85 uh, pound dumbbells. I did five sets of eight reps, and uh, again, I was trying to emphasis on just having a mind-muscle connection today, because like I was saying, the gym was full, so it kind of like uh, took me out of my uh, mind frame. I couldn't really use that as an excuse, but you know, it's not all days you're going to be feeling the greatest or have situations that's going to be the way you want it, so you just take it with a, grain of, uh, a good grain of salt. Uh, so what I did afterwards, I went and I did the uh, tricep kickbacks using 30 pound uh, dumbbells and I did four sets of 10. Uh, as you guys know, I usually do the uh, triceps with uh, my shoulders, but unfortunately, if you remember, I only did uh, shoulders for that day. So I uh, incorporated the uh, triceps to go with the chest and the, uh, the back movements that I did for today. So afterwards, after doing the kickbacks, I went into doing the 120 pound uh, dumbbell rows and I did this uh, for four sets uh, with eight reps and making sure that I uh, get a proper squeeze. As you can see, I'm trying to make sure I don't uh, really just try to throw the weight and actually squeeze on every uh, rep uh, that I'm doing. Uh, check out those calves though, by the way. And uh, afterwards, I went into doing the uh, cable row. And now again, like I was saying before, uh, I apologize. I'll start by saying I apologize for the camera angles because it's not gonna. I don't have a cameraman, so I'm kind of really just recording things myself. So after I actually position the camera and I go and sit, uh, do whatever uh, exercise I'm doing, I really don't know how it's looking. So uh, I did this the cable rows for 120 pounds. I did four sets of eight, and then. Uh, Here's a prime example of my camera angles. I finished the, uh, the day off doing uh, tricep uh, push downs. Uh, and if you guys have been watching uh, my last few videos of doing uh, the tricep pull downs, uh, I did. Uh, I start off for a pump. I start off with 120 pounds and I work my way down doing reps of eight. So I would do again uh, 120 pounds, then go down to uh, 110 pounds. Uh, 100, then 100, then 90, 80, etc., etc. Going, making it down to 50, and doing eight reps for each set of that I'm doing, and doing it at a continuous rate where you know there's no stopping and uh, getting it done to get a proper pump. So this is again what I did for today's uh, bench press uh, powerlifting uh, session. Uh, please make sure you uh, like. The All video. right, guys. Now, as you can see, that was not one of the best videos that I've uh, or clippings that I've ever shown you guys. As you saw that the uh, gym was so full that, uh, that this morning that uh, I only could record things pretty close and not with uh, the best uh, angles and, and views. But I tried to give you guys as much as I possibly could. 
because again, I don't have a cameraman or anything like that, so I'm pretty much just going off a whim and trying to get angles the way I can. I actually uh, plan on getting a camera hopefully very soon, so I could actually uh, do that flip thing where I could actually see exactly what I am recording, so I don't you know mess up and do crappy angles, etc., etc. And hopefully, I can get it into uh, 1080p and get you guys more quality videos as well. So. I hope you guys are liking the content that I'm bringing to you. Uh, if you guys are liking the content that I'm bringing to you again, don't forget to hit that like button because again, just showing that like button is letting me, is giving me the confidence to keep doing the same thing I'm doing and uh, bring you guys the best content I possibly can. And again, if you guys are have ideas or suggestions you think that I could do to make my videos better or content or things that I could bring to the table that you guys would like to see, make sure you let, let me know in the comment section. Again, suggest it and uh, share it with anybody else that is in the powerlifting or power building or the bodybuilding or fitness world and let them know that uh, my channel is here and to subscribe. Uh, please let them know that uh, they can message me anytime if they want to do a collaboration, anything. Just, you know, let them know that, that uh, this channel exists. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe, any suggest. And always remember, at the end of the day, flex them guns. Bullet.